Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I have some not so exciting news. We're gonna talk about the things that I don't wanna talk about. I've avoided making this video. Let's just dive right in. Okay, so <clears throat> first of all, I have a goal while filming this video, all right? I have new standards for myself and one of them is to be strong. A woman of strength who does not weep and cry on her channel, oh no. No, no, no. We've had one too many thumbnails of me crying, and guess what? I'm well aware that I am not a pretty crier. I look so sad and pathetic. Is there a pretty crier out there? I don't know. Probably. I'm not that. Um, so when I see thumbnails of like, Tati's a victim again, and I'm like, you know, like, it's really just does something to you. On the good side, it does make you a bit stronger. So I'm feeling a little bit tougher. You know, having gone through some of the turbulence that comes with creating content on the internet. So that is goal number one, no tears today. This is a moment of strength, gratitude, despite some dark days, moving forward, and just kind of getting on with it. You guys have wanted to know about Tati Beauty. You have wanted an update. So many people have been like, I bet she's stirring the pot to uh, launch a new collection. And you know what? I wish that was the case. I really do. It's not. And it's been hard to be silent online and not be like, you're wrong. This is what I dealt with today. But you know, I, I've been also taught a great deal about patience over the past year. So the timing had to be correct for me to sit down where decisions were made very final and let you all know that Tati Beauty is closing its doors. Um, we are no longer selling product online. And I say that with a heavy heart. I have loved creating this brand. I had huge goals, dreams, visions for the future. And you guys know, prior to reviewing product on YouTube, I have been a lifelong makeup lover. From the time I was this big, from the time I was in my mom's stomach, I just, from the time I was itty bitty, I have loved color, creating, makeup, the artistry of it. And, you know, I had big plans and all these collections and things I wanted to do. And so in my mind, creating a brand was a huge goal, like before I even started YouTube. And the way I'm choosing to look at it now is I got to do that. I had the pleasure of creating a palette that I love. To this day, it is my favorite. The team I worked with, I have nothing but wonderful memories of working with them. We were able to create a product that sold a ton. Like this was a mega successful brand for a first time launch to sell out in 12 hours, all inventory to continue to do well for us to be developing future launches. We launched the Blendiful shortly after that did really well also. And then COVID hit and that definitely slowed things down. It slowed the whole world down. And then of course you guys are aware of the outside litigation that really impacted my life in full. So that kind of T-boned everything and here we are. I wish things were different. I wish that I could still be launching, creating, doing the whole A to Z thing for Tati Beauty. It just did not work out. I'm sad about it, but again, I'm really, really grateful that I had the opportunity to launch what I did to work with such an amazing team. You know, some of the best in the business, the formula that we were able to come up with was top notch. I'm so proud of everything that we did together. So there's no drama, no weird hard feelings, Feelings, there's no scandal. There's just timing of the world and sadly outside litigation that had a huge impact. And that's just my life right now. And I'm hopeful for better days ahead. Do I wish things could be totally different right now? Of course, you know, but it is what it is. I'm accepting it with a smile and with strength and just kind of trusting that God has a different path because sometimes when your whole life does this, that's really all you have to cling to and just know that there are better days ahead. Sometimes we don't have to have everything figured out and sometimes our big question marks we're not gonna understand until later on. And I think this is one of those. So instead of crying about it and being depressed about it and kind of staying in that state, I'm choosing to move forward and just enjoy making videos and reviewing makeup and just seeing what next chapters bring. 
So that is my good attitude about this. I want to say to you guys, thank you so, so much for all of your support. I mean, I get the most emotional, not even just things coming to like a final close. But when I look at the makeup looks that you guys created with the palette, or I think back to the beautiful launch party where I had subscribers there with me and that was just such an epic night. And I think of all the memories in between of bringing this to life and the good times. And that's what hits my heart the most. You know, I would have loved a little more of that, but I'll treasure the time that I had with the brand. I'll treasure the looks that you guys created, the excitement that we all had together over it. And it will just be something that I can, you know, look back in my life and be really proud of. So there you have it. You guys are amazing, amazing for the support that you provide me all of the time with your DMs, just your emails, even your comments here. It means the world to me. It keeps me going. It keeps me hopeful and motivated. So thank you guys so, so much. I hope you are having a good one, whatever you are doing, and regular content will resume next week. I don't have much more to say other than I'm happy to finally get this off my chest. If you're really sad about this, you know, I'm a little bit sad too, but I'm not giving up on ever having brands again in the future. You know, I definitely still want to be a creative and create different products. We'll just have to kind of see what the next steps ahead look like. But in the meantime, I'll continue reviewing products and doing makeup tutorials and having fun here on YouTube. So if you're into that, make sure you're subscribed, ring the bell. And otherwise, go have a good one, whatever you are doing. I love you all so much. And I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah. Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I am excited to finally show you the Tati Beauty Textured Neutrals Palette Volume 1. This is the PR box, you guys. I love product and I love color and I love makeup and I love creating. I had such an incredible time at the event that I hosted for subscribers. It was just pure magic. I'm so grateful for the love that I feel when I look around and I speak to all of you. And this is why I have stayed making videos for nine years, because you guys matter to me so much. You all look beautiful too. So thank you for being here. And I love you.